Unlike many of my peers, all of whom sure are sure that they are right and I am wrong, I have never seen anything particularly harmful about the Federal Bureau of Investigation. I've not been overly impressed by their acumen when it came to the Kennedy assassination. I'm certainly at sea as how they could have overlooked all of the things that I found in my research. But I do know that there are problems at large that need professional policemen, and you would assume that congressional oversight led to the most reputable people being um, in power, at least in theory. Okay, I mean, so I don't go out of my way to bother them or to put them down or anything like that. And the few times I've met them, they seem, you know, congenial enough. But, you know, the history of the story of Mount Desert Island, I put it, you know, in the newspaper at school. And I mentioned the FBI, and they just wanted to know, did I think they did it? Well, what did, what makes them think I thought they did it? I reported specifically who said what, when, and where. I mean, it was obviously little help, you know? And it, it became slowly but surely clear that the administration of school, the local police, my so-called peers... Um, foreign in, 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 in investigation, like from Penis Gabriel, the whole objective of each and every one of them, the hospitals, the, uh, the recovery program, the Christians, the feminists, the queers, the whole objective of each and every single person I talked to, Hollywood, was to lie and cover up and desist and, and resist in every way, in every particular, in every manner, any form of investigation that might be even considered. You know, I mean, I went to the main state polygraph room. I, had, I passed, later passed the stress evaluator. He said, you're obviously telling the truth about this. And if they had listened to any reasonable analysis of the evidence or looked at it for themselves or stopped lying about what they knew that I knew that I didn't know, they knew that I didn't know, like about the neurotoxin that had been used on me, we might have been in a position to confront these people and stop them before they struck again with this bonus thing they did. Now, why wouldn't they want to do that? Apparently, they were afraid of empowering ideas, far-out idealistic ideas about saving the world from climate change and so on. Wait till we get this stuff finished, and then we'll see. Is that what was going on even in the FBI, or are they just, are they just doofus? You know, I don't, I don't have no idea how to explain what, what happened and what didn't happen in terms of the way the authorities disrespect to me. Look what they did. Not only did they poison me in the mouth, but they kept me in under lock and key, staring into space to prove that I wasn't dangerous to somebody I had largely forgotten from high school. And refusing to allow me to go to school while they encouraged these ripper hatters to go around murdering innocent people. They literally encouraged them and covered for them. And they allowed the evidence to circulate like nothing was wrong. I mean, who cares, right? And 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 in all of the weird things that led up to this situation, they were just do do. Now, what could possibly be going on? What could be going through their minds? You know, you always get you know tuned into these devious attitudes about things like. Drugs and abortion and homelessness. How does that add up? You know, it's not murder, it's depopulating. That's different. Is that what you're saying? You know, or, or, or what's, what's abortion got to do with it? Abortion was passed by Congress. You know, you, it doesn't have anything to do with transforming the human race by injecting the blood. I mean, the, those people were legally Nazi. They were circulating Goebbels and 
yada yappy dot comes in defending Flame Over Africa from Senegal. I mean, why is he defending Flame Over Africa from Senegal? And these gullibles people. What could it possibly have to do with? I mean, Penis Gabriel snuck everything by the Federal Communications Commission. I mean, the FCC must have known what he was up to. So, you know, what, what what's going on? You know, I mean, as I say, you know, it, they, they probably said, well, if you can't convince your peers, what do you mean if I can't convince my peers? I know several people who heard me out and looked at the evidence and said, that's wrong. Well, if you can't convince your peers, how can you expect us to believe anything you say? Maybe because you're smarter than my peers. You ever think of that? I mean, I don't understand. Don't try to make me understand. You know, because I don't understand. The only thing I understand is that you're irrational and you're lying. And that's where we're coming from, right?